Okay, so I'm back, and I probably haven't uploaded anything in about maybe almost a year. Part of that is just because, like, I don't really know what else to do with Batch. But there's been a few people that have been commenting and wondering how I got multiplayer working on pretty much most of my games that I've been making. So I made kind of like an add-in program, kind of like Shade Engine. And also on the topic of Shade Engine, there is a new patch out for it I just released today. Um, that fixes a lot of the issues that it had, like you can't draw like models on there, and also some speed increases, like the rendering itself, although it's pretty fast already, but now it's faster. Anyways, getting into the multiplayer, or the multiplayer file that adds it into your games. Um, pretty much, this is just the documentation. Um, you can look through it once you download it, there is a download link in the description. And uh, you just add in this file, and it would look something kind of like this. So here's a host. Just resize that here. And start a tester. There we are. And kind of like you'll have the tester or like client or whatever running on a loop. And the host can also interact with the game. Like you can say, like, hello, client. Enter. And it would send the data. Now you press any key to update it. And there we go, it says, hello, client. And this is not just something that's pre-programmed into that. I can change it. Like, I can run host again. And I can resize that again. There we are. I can say something else, like Bob. And read it. There we go. It says Bob now. So that's, it does work. You can try it out for yourself. And, uh, yeah, that's it.